Claudel, I have to ask you this question. 1992, you agreed to chair the United Way campaign with your husband Dave. You were the first female to take on that role. What'd you think? It was looked upon as a, uh, you know, a feather in your cap. I, I loved every minute of it. I visited every agency. It went by myself a lot of times, but a lot of times I would call somebody from United Way and go with me. And so we visited all the agencies to see just exactly what they were doing. Were there challenges for you as a female leader in this community because you were a female? Yes, uh, just because I was a female. Uh, people didn't understand I knew who I was, uh, what I was, where I was going, and uh, what my heart said. Once they talked to me, they kind of left me alone. Were there any other female community leaders in such important roles at that time? No, I don't think so. I, uh, I think there were some uh, very important women that, that had roles uh, probably as, as big as mine, but I didn't think so. I think the, uh, we thought the United Way was first on the list, and it probably was. In the amount of money we've raised, uh, the amount of people that we touched. You know the United Way inside and out, nuts and bolts. You've been a volunteer for so many years. You've been a leader of the organization for so many years. You've been a contributor so, for so many years. What's the secret of success for the United Way, in your opinion? Well, I think a lot of it is the, are the leaders. The honesty, the, uh, the people that are involved in it, uh, really truly believe in the United Way and that they'll do their darndest to make sure that we reach that goal. You've seen it how many years? And it's just absolutely amazing that a town this size can do that. I have to give you credit because credit is deserved. You brought the Day of Caring to Tulsa, Oklahoma. Well, we had gone to a national seminar that um, was held in Michigan or someplace and heard about Day of Caring. Hit me, just thought, that's exactly, exactly what we need to start the things off. And uh, so we came home and talked about it and talked about it and decided to go with it. And uh, what a blessing that was uh, to know that people could go out and paint and, and uh, mow grass and uh, do so many little things that would help people so much. Clydella, what advice would you give women in the community today as a mentor that are interested in becoming more involved, giving back? What, what would your advice be for them? When you look at your life, uh, you have uh, mentored some people and don't know it. It's just by the way you teach, the way you live, uh, the way you do things, I think is most important in mentoring. Uh, people see what you do and uh, can feel free to copy that. So uh, well, mentoring is very, very important to all of us.